Hey, it's your brother D on the VWB, world famous Venice Beach Boardwalk. And today we're at the famous Venice Drum Circle. And we're here standing here with David Kim, who is a drum participant. David, say what's up to the people. Hey, what's up, everybody? All right, awesome, David. So, David, when did you first start playing drums? i say about 20, 30 years ago, something like that. About 20, 30 years? Awesome, man. So you've been playing for a minute, huh? Yes, a little while, a little bit. And what, what inspired you to pick up a drum and start playing? Uh, this drum circle right here. It's pretty much been my whole inspiration, you know? Yeah. So I'm here at the Venice Drum Circle with John Ross. John, say what's up to the people, man. Hello, folks. How you doing? Cool. So, hey, John, uh, what uh, inspired you uh, to first pick up a drum? Ooh, that's a tough question. I was probably like nine years old and something inspired me and I wanted a drum set and they were like, heck no. And eventually I got one when I was 14 and it's like I couldn't stop playing. I don't know, I put on... So you, did, you, did, you did a lot of dishes, you cleaned up the house every Saturday. What'd you do? You did a lot of stuff to get that drum set, huh? I have no idea. I was just lucky. You know, I had good parents and they got me a set and uh, I never looked back. I'm here speaking with Atusa, drum circle participant. Atusa, say what's up to the people. Hey, what's up, people? Awesome, awesome. So, Atusa, what inspired you uh, to first become a drummer? I love music. I love rhythm. It's in all of us. So, I just decided one day I'm gonna drum, and uh, and since then I've been drumming, and it's never too late to start. I started tapping my fingers, I started watching videos, I bought a drum, I joined the drum circle in my community, and then I just started playing. I started playing with the community, I started playing by myself. It just became a lifestyle. And now, wherever I'm at, I find a drum circle, and I bring my drum, and especially this one here, it's on the beach, you catch the sunset, you're playing music, it's fun. So I'm here with drum participant Paul Friedman. Paul, say what's up to the people. What's up, people? Awesome, Paul. Awesome, my man. Why so, aren't you here? Yes, why are you not here? Exactly. The party is here, baby. So, hey, Paul, tell me a little bit about this drum that I got uh, that you got right here. It's, it's a beautiful called, drum. It's called the djembe, and it's got a goat skin, and it's usually handmade, uh, and it's a nice drum. It's kind of vintage. It's about 50 years old. Uh, my daughter got it for me five, six years ago, but I've been playing for about almost 25 years. Wow, that's so, awesome, amazing. So you, you, so you feel you've worn it in at this point, that it's, it's yours, that you've made it yours? Oh, 24 years ago. You know, not an issue. So this is, this is serious stuff we do down here. And so what keeps you coming out to a Venice Beach Drum Circle? I know there's uh, other drum circles out here in L.A., but what it is about Venice Drum Circle uh, that makes it so special? It's, I would say there's a lot of love out here. There's a certain kind of vibe out here. It's kind of adventurous and bordering on mystical, magical, if you, if you, you, know, if you can see that. It's, uh, it's a really wonderful vibe. It's a very unique vibe out here, very free-spirited. What about uh, this drum circle here in Venice that keeps you coming here? Well, I live nearby, first of all, but uh, really it was where I came during the pandemic. It was the only place I could come, and uh, and then I just and I just watched. And then later I was like, "Gee, I got a drum," and they said, "Well, you should come down." And I was like, "And I've been coming ever since." So it's. Uh, and then I didn't realize how sort of addicted I would get to sort of the rhythms, and it's amazing. Uh, there's nothing like it anywhere. I've been around somewhat and there's nothing like it. Listen to this guy. He knows. He's been around. You heard him. Thank you so much for talking to us, brother. That's, thanks, thanks, Dave. Appreciate it. Yeah, man. The rhythms for me is what gets me in coming back. No matter what kind of a day it is, we're going to make some good sounds. Got to get that rhythm. Awesome, brother. John, thanks so much for talking to us, brother. Appreciate right. it, man. Thank you. You got it. Bye. Hey, guys. That was another show. Thanks for tuning in. We'll catch you next time. Be blessed. Thank you.